Hey, so there's another question from Sarah, which is how do you explain to people or give permission to people to move freely and unwind while they're on the table? And I would say um, when I have my first visit with people, what I will do is I will say, don't feel like you need to lie there and be still and be good. You have all the time in the world to do that in the outside world. Here, I want you to get in touch with your body. If you feel like taking a deep breath, that really helps both of us. Um, if you feel like stretching or wiggling, if you feel uncomfortable in the position that you're in, please feel free to change your position. I can work around anything. If you're uncomfortable lying down, sit up. If you need to take a walk, take a walk. And that's really helpful for people just in the beginning to understand that they don't have to lie there rigidly and, and receive. Um, and in general, that's enough. The other thing that uh, happens in practice that will happen organically for you is that as you have kids come in and get checked, uh, when they get on the table, they are all about the wiggle, right? And the parents will automatically say, stop wiggling. At that point, you say, no, 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 no. They are listening to their system. They are listening to the way their body needs to unwind these tension patterns that are being stored in them. So if we could all wiggle like they do, this whole process would be so much easier for all of us. So if, if you have a newborn come in, also that is the most magical thing because everybody gets up and watch as the baby gets checked. And um, everybody knows, well, babies are dogs or animals. You can't direct a baby. You can't direct a dog or a cat or a horse to do what you want them to. You can't direct them to take a deep breath, but they do. And so automatically people start to see people people or, or essences, beings that are tap, tapped into their um, truest nature and don't have the whole head drama going on, those are the ones that are going to release the tension patterns as quickly as possible. So they're great examples to have if you can schedule new people while you have kids or animals coming into the office. That's a wonderful um, way to encourage in a visual way what is going on when you're um, allowing them to move on the table. 